Today, I am shopping for a present for my Minnie Mouse loving toddler niece at Disneyland. I sometimes struggle to shop for her because she's the second born and between her and her sister, they just have so much cool stuff. So what I decided to do today was have her walk around the Emporium on Main Street with me and point to all the cool toys and show me everything she wanted. And then later on, I went back in without her to make the actual purchases. There was also a special discount for Magic Key holders from September 21st to October 14th for 30% off select merchandise at certain locations. And I haven't found anything this discount hasn't worked on so far, so it is a really good one. I also am going to link as many of these products down below in the description. So the first thing that she found was the Simba plush. It's super cute. She's into the Lion King right now, and this was $44.99. She also really liked this sleeping Olaf plush, and he is $39.99. She was so excited to see this Grogu cuddly. She loves Baby Yoda and Star Wars, and he is also $39.99. She did point out all of these Mickey Minis because she is a Mickey Mickey freak, but I think she's also, she already has like most of these Minis, except this pink one that I don't think she has yet. She was $29.99, and then I was trying, I was thinking about pushing Ratatouille, but she's not super into it yet, but he is $29.99. I might have to come back for him for myself. We then went over to the Turning Red section where she loves this Turning Red um, Panda Nightlight. It's $27.99. Her and her sister point this out every single time. I'm definitely going to end up getting it eventually for them. She also really liked the turning red doll, and the doll is $34.99 and super cute. For more Minnie and Mickeys, and she points to every single Mickey and Minnie and wants it, but specifically this Play in the Park Minnie, she's super cute, and she is $24.99. She also got excited to see this Christmas light up group plush. He's $26.99. I was thinking about getting him because I loved him too, but I don't think she really knows who Groot is, so I did pass on the little Groot. This is one of my favorite sections, the cars section. She pointed to this uh, Mater 6-inch RC car. He's $24.99. They also had the Lightning McQueen 6-inch RC car, and he was also $24.99. But I ended up not getting him because, sadly, they only had one of him, and he was a little bit damaged. She did also like the Piston Cup light-up toy that is $20. And then we got to another favorite section of her, another Minnie Mouse section. They've had this vet set for a while. It's um, $29.99. Her older sister has asked for it. She's asked for it before. They both really like it because they like cats and minis. So that was a top contender. They also had a dog bath Minnie Mouse toy. It's also $29.99. She also loved these um, keychains or purse charms. They were $14.99. She loved the Olaf one, but there were lots of characters that she pretty much liked all of them. And I thought these might be good for like um, a clip-on, like a stroller clip-on toy. She's also a Donald lover, so she loved this Donald Duck magnet that was $11.99. She also loves these Loungefly Grogu ears. They're $39.99 and so cute. We then found this stitched in the train. It's $9.99. It's just a cute little toy. And then we went back to the car section and they had restocked and had a new Lightning McQueen toy that was not broken and it makes noise and sound and cost $14.99. What I ended up getting her for her birthday was the Minnie Mouse Vet Set. Just because I've seen her look at this so many times in the past. And this time I thought she would really appreciate it. I also got her the Lightning McQueen toy that makes sound and moves. Because I thought she would like that. And we've been watching Cars together and, you know, going to Cars Land in DCA. So I thought she would like that for her birthday. So thanks for shopping with me and I'll see you real soon.